Hey guys, welcome to week three of I Am 130. So it really looks like everybody's getting uh, started quite well in this class. A few hiccups with one or two, but no big deal. So really happy with what I'm seeing. So let me go over what we're going to be doing this week. So this week you're going to be finishing up some work relating to module two. Um, you also have your reflection one that is going to be in the discussion board. And then uh, just again, make sure you're looking at the schedule for week three and always contact me if you have any questions. So let's take a look at the syllabus. So let's go ahead and go down to the schedule. And actually this is the schedule document. So we'll move down here to week three. So we're working on week three. We've got the module two review assignment uh, that is in the book. You'll be submitting your files through the link in Blackboard. Same thing for case one and case three. So make sure you're paying attention. We're not doing all the assignments in the back of the book. So let's take a look at that book. Let me go ahead and go back to mind tap here. So let me go to, this is the ebook and Sam. Go ahead and go to module two. And then I'm, I just clicked on the open book. All right, let's go to the chapter content. So I'm just going to scroll down, take a look at the uh, <clears throat> review assignment. So for the review assignment, this just gives you some background information. Reminder that you will be going to your IM130 folder, open up your Word 2 folder, and then open up the review folder. That's where you will find any files that you need to open, and that's where you will also be saving all of your files. Um, just a reminder again, you're going to be zipping the folder that contains all those files, even the starting files. So don't worry about sending me everything that's in the uh, review folder. All right, so keep that in mind. Um, you're going to read the first comment. So this one you're dealing with comments and you're going to be actually following up on whatever those comments tell you to do. Now, as you're going through this, make sure you're checking off each of these steps so that you don't miss anything. Um, you will be doing a report in MLA uh, style, so keep that in mind. Refer back to the Module 2 uh, example of doing an MLA style report. All right, so you know, make sure you keep all that in mind. And folks, make sure you are reading these instructions thoroughly. All right, um, let me go ahead and go to the next one. Then you have the Case 1. So here you have background information on case one. So you're going to open up the file called field. Again, you're going to go to the Word 2 folder, and then you're going to open up the case one folder. Then you're going to do a save as command and save that file as field trip flyer. Again, it goes in the case one folder. You're going to be zipping the case one folder and submitting that through the assignment link in Blackboard. Again, I don't care the other files that are in there. I'm going to see the starting files plus the ones that you're actually creating. So make sure you're reading through this thoroughly. Um, also keep in mind that I do have the keys in Blackboard. Those are keys not to be opened up in Word and used. So that just gives you an idea of what your finished product should look like. So if it's not looking like that, go back to the step um, in those instructions and see what you missed. All right. Okay. So then let's go ahead and take a look at, uh, we're going to skip case two and you're going to go to case three. All right. Oh, I think I want one too many. Let's go back. All right. So case three, you're going to be dealing with a couple files. Uh, again, you're getting the background information. You're going to go to the Word 2 folder, and then you're going to go into the case three folder to open up the files and then save it according to the book instructions. Don't add anything to the file names. Don't add your initials or anything. I know who's submitting what. So please make sure you're following the directions. Now this one, you're going to be dealing with a resume. Again, make sure you're looking at the key. Um, now this one, they give you an example of what it's going to look like so you can tell what the formatting should be. This should be one file. So if you're going to two pages, you've got some spacing issues. Maybe you've added uh, spacing after or before in some of these paragraphs and you shouldn't have. So you want to make sure you keep that in mind. All right, so let's go back over to um, the uh, discussion board. This is where you're going to find your reflection one. All right. Hopefully it's going to pop up here. So uh, just a reminder, you've got the post state when you have to post your answer to the question or questions, and then you have the reply. So this is a two part. Um, you have to not only reply to the question that I have, but then go back later on and then click reply to one of your classmates and, and give a thorough response to um, what they're posting as well. 
Uh, we don't have any quizzes this week coming up, so everything should be good to go. Uh, if you go to the weekly folder, keep in mind when you're looking at the weekly folder, uh, this is pretty much a repeat of what you're seeing on the assignment schedule, other than I do list the student outcomes, which is part of the book. So we have the schedules. is no different than what you saw in the schedule. It's just a copy and paste. Um, and then I just indicate from this point on down, these are things that are supporting material, supporting links relating to working on Module 2 assignments. So if you want the grading rubrics, which is what I give you guys when you uh, complete a work and I send it back to you through the uh, uh, assignment links, actually when you click on my grades, you'll see the blue icon and you'll see your files. I add a rubric file in there so you can see the breakdown of your grades. Um, and this is just a link that's going to take you over here to the book assign or the book solution. And this is just a link that's going to take you over here to where you submit your book assignments. And this is just a link that's going to take you over here to the discussion board. And if you're into the PowerPoints, you can go to this link down here for the PowerPoints and any, any videos. All right. But we pretty much hang out in this section here. This is just supporting material. Hence, it says supporting material. So if you guys have any questions about uh, this week's work, give me a call. Have